Hi everyone, we have come to the first part of our lecture where we'll be discussing on the meaning, concepts, nature, scope of transportation planning problems in developing countries. Meaning of transportation. Transportation, the movement of goods and persons from place to place and various means by which such movement is accomplished. In other words, the action of transport is defined as a particular movement of an organism or things from one point to another. Transport refers to the activities that facilitate physical movement of goods as well as individual from one place to another. For instance, in business, it is considered as an auxiliary to trade. That means it supports trade and industry in carrying raw materials to the place of production and distributing finishing goods for consumption individual or business firm that engage themselves in such are called transporters. What is transport planning? What is transport planning? Transport planning is as well defined as planning required in the operation, provision, and management of facilities and services for the mode of transport to achieve safer, faster, comfortable, convenient, economical, and environment-friendly movements of people and goods. Transport planning is highly essential in shaping cities, enabling economic activities, promoting community interactions, and enhancing qualities of life. It is also essential for sustainable development and ensuring safe accessibility at various level for all individuals. Importance of transportation. Importance of transportation. What are the importance of transportation? One, transportation makes available raw materials to manufacturers or producers. Transportation makes available raw materials to manufacturers or producers. Transport makes it possible to carry raw materials from place where they are available to place where they can be processed and assembled into finished goods. Transportation makes it very convenient and possible to carry raw materials from place where they are available to place where they can be processed, assembled into finished goods. Transportation makes available goods to consumers. Transportation makes available goods to consumers. Transport make possible movement of goods from one place to another with great ease and speed. Thus, consumers spread in different parts of the countries have the benefit of consuming goods produced at distance places. 
it's a high standard of living. Transportation, a high standard of standard of living. Easy means of transportation facilitate large scale production at low cost. It gives consumers the choice to make use of different quantities of goods at different prices. D. Transportation helps during emergency and natural calamities. It helps during emergency and natural calamities. For instance, in times of national crisis due to wars or internal disturbance, transport helps in quick movement of troops and the supplies needed in the operations. Transportation helps during emergency and natural calamities. E, transportation helps in creation of opportunities for those that don't have job. For, in, for, for instance, is the creation of employment. Transport provides employment opportunities to individuals as drivers, conductors, pilots, cabin crew, captains of the ships who are directly engaged in transport businesses. It also provides opportunity of employment for people indirectly in the industry producing various means of transport and other transport equipment. Moreover, transport helps in labor mobility. Transport helps in labor mobility. Transport helps a lot in providing mobility to workers. You will be aware that people from one country go to foreign countries to work in different industries and factories. Lastly, transport helps in bringing nations together. It helps in bringing nations together. Transport facilitates movement of people from one country to another, which helps in exchange of culture, fields, and practice between the people of different countries. This brings about greater understanding among people and awareness about different countries. Thus, it helps to promote a feeling of international brotherhood. Transportation helps in promoting the feelings of international brotherhood. We move gradually to concept of transportation. Concept of transportations. For the purpose of this lecture, we'll be discussing just only three concepts of transportation, which are modern transport management concepts, multimodal transport concepts, and commuter traffic concepts multimodal transport process concepts and commuter traffic concepts but firstly let's discuss about modern traffic management concepts modern traffic management concepts is strictly for an improved mobility and congestions reducing management parking facilities energy conservation and pollution emission reduction which improve non-motorized transportation and spur reductions whose goals and objectives are to improve access, to improve safety, to improve health, improve transport reliability, improve energy efficiency, environmental protection, and more of efficient land use. Modern transport is to control the trips demand distribution of peak demand and engaging by encouraging public bicycle and walking modes. This method of modern transport management, however, include the below aspect. the method of modern transport management include the below aspects which are integrated land use transport planning zonal concepts it-based communication intelligent transport system 
ITs in towns and cities built operate transfer BOT systems. Integrated land use and transport planning. For effective reductions of the adverse impacts of current transportation system, it is very important to influence future and existing transportation and land use development pattern. Once there is land use and transportation integrated, there will be possible increase in accessibility without any need for automobile transfer. Once there is land use and transportation integrated, there will be positive and possible increase in accessibility without any need for automobile transfer. Two, zona concept. Land division into different land use such as residential, commercial, industrial, civic, institutional, and recreational. In which the regulation protects and prevents the in use of land and building to limit the height and density of population from different zones. As traffic is, however, generated from different land uses, the zonal concepts play a huge role to provide an efficient transportation plan. IT-based communication. The use of computer is now extended into almost all field of human endeavor, where transport is not exceptional. Intelligent system, which is called transport telematic, include a wide range of tools and services. This system have a potential to deliver significant benefits with respect to operational efficiency. In Intelligent transport system. Intelligent transport system. Transport authority now has said that simply building more road is ready a solution to the almost universal problem of road traffic congestion. It is essential to find ways of managing traffic more efficiently on existing roads and of increasing the use of other modes, modes of transport by travelers and friends. This range of system now available is extensive, including support for commercial freight and public transport services, as well as vehicle telematic and traveler information. ITS in cities and towns. ITS in city and towns. Most major urban areas in Europe are already using various types of ITS in order to support the control and management of traffic and public transport operation, as well as for enforcement and access control. The last but not the least under modern transport system concept is build operate transfer, BOT system. This system means one body will build an infrastructure and operate for a certain time before handing it over to another body by negotiation. By this process, many roads, bridges, bus terminals, air terminals are being built and ultimately resources are using efficiently. By this system, modern transport system is improving rapidly and will keep improving rapidly. We move to multimodal transport concepts. Multimodal transport concepts. Multimodal transport concept, also known as combined transport, is the transportation of goods under a single contract. Multimodal transport concepts. It's also known as a combined transport of goods under a single contract, but performed with at least two different modes of transport. The carrier is liable in a legal sense for the entire carriage, even though it's performed by several business modes of transport, such as rain, sea, road, for example. 
the carrier does not have to act to process all the means of transport and in practical usage, usage does not is involved the carrier res is responsible for the entire carriage which and they are called multimodal transport operator commuter travel concept committee is periodically re reoccurring travel between one place of residence and place of work or study nature of transportation enhancing mobility has many positive effect on economic development and social welfare, including more efficient movement of goods and improved access to job, health service, and education. However, if enhanced mobility is achieved primarily through increased reliance on conventional private cars, it can miss diverting substantial financial resources to roads and solving worse air pollution and traffic congestion. The benefits are enormous, but the cost can be also substantial. Most developing countries are experiencing rapid production of population growth and urbanization and many fast-growing economies. Scope of transportation. Transport is one of the main key branches playing a crucial role in the development of economics. Reliable and properly organized transport systems are required for a professional performance of industries, constructions, and agriculture. The public mode of efficiency of work also largely depends on the valuable functions of a carefully chosen transport system. A steady increase in transportation is accomplished by going under demand for a higher qualities of transport service and ultimatum efficiency of transport performances. Thank you for listening, but please check for your test of assessment.